Do things when you want me to Like controller Controller Yeah, like controller My lovely peoples, how are you doing? I hope everybody's fine and being blessed. I'm out taking me a little walk through the neighborhood and just updating you guys on everything. Nothing ain't going on too much, so I don't have that much to update you guys on. Yeah, so I'm just walking. Getting a little fresh air, you know, although I've been, you know, outside working and stuff, but I'm just, you know, trying to ease my mind. This is what I do. I just take a walk in the neighborhood. Yes, guys, I did this short look to my hair. I'm trying to get used to it. Y'all don't see it that much. I'm trying to get used to it, but oh well, it's hot. I don't want no long hair on me or nothing, so. I just decided to go with this. I did it myself, tried my best. And I'm gonna keep doing it because practice makes perfect. I don't have no time to be spending all that money in a hairdresser when it's simple and easy. All it does is take time and practice. And that's what I'm doing. So it's gonna get better. I'm gonna do a couple more winter time like when it gets to fall and winter time I'm gonna do um the medium length ones and some some long ones to myself because I want to practice and practice and get better and <clears throat> just start doing my hair myself you know this was my first my second try the picture that I have on Facebook I did that one too by myself and this is a shorter shorter one it's a, the 27 inches, and um, yeah, got my little ice water because I do freeze my water overnight, and it lasts me for a day, so I always have ice water. Sometimes I just gotta buy water and fill it up with the ice, and that keeps me good for the day. I've been trying to drink a lot of water, stay healthy, stay fit, and try to do things on my own when I have the time. I'm on a budget, saving. It's almost back to school for the kids in New York, so have to be on a budget, on a savings and stuff. So that's what I'm doing. So guys, that's about it, you know? Yeah. So I don't know, it's nothing too much going on just that I'm back to school shopping for the kids I probably do a little haul on the things I got from the shade I went to Walmart and I picked up some stuff a little bit of book supplies school supplies and I picked up some um, what is that from Target I picked up some from Target and I picked up some from like like little family dollars and stuff have sales so I went to different stores so I may be doing a haul I don't know but guys yes hold on one second yes guys I'm back but yeah like it's muggy out here it's letting me feel like you hear me keep taking deep breaths I'm sure the shortness of breath so that's what it is that's what's going on but ain't nothing too much. Just want to let y'all see my little short short too. I hope you know. See, I'm working on my face again. Always been working on it, but it's like my face is getting tired of um that soap now. It's not working anymore. So I'm on to something new. So hopefully that will work. I think it will though, but I'm gonna stop right here. Gotta catch some breath underneath this tree. 
and the rain came down guys and it made it even worse like muggier and hot but like I said nothing really going on getting the kids ready back for school um still working working hard you know life struggles of a mom you know that's going on life struggles you know stuff like that and that's about it guys I'm just relaxing thanking God I had a good talk with one of my good old friends today and she gave me some good words of advice and that made me feel much better because I was down and out you know being that it was my you know my baby passed away and this month in August 2016 she would have been just making one years old you know she would have been a year and a couple of days old so I was kind of sad and down and out and you know she gave me a lot of words of encouragement motivation and word of wisdom so I was just really 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 truly happy for that because you don't have a lot of friends today that's real and that's going to stick by you through your hard times and your battles your struggles they're not going to stick with you so when you have that good friend and you and them talk about something and you you talk about something that you don't like or you see something that you don't like and you approach them and you turn not approach them or you talk to them about it and they um you know talk to you about it and they still confront you like that and you can know it's real from the bottom of their heart that's what a friend is a true friend is you know what i'm saying that's what a true friend is and there's not no friend that i just met a couple months ago a year ago two years ago three years ago it's over a decade you know what i'm saying i have a lot of friends like that but i really don't associate with them that much we will talk but i don't associate with them that much they haven't did nothing what my eyes can see they haven't did anything to me i just like you know back up and give people their space and their time I don't have nothing against anybody, but I just let people have their space and their time because, you know, I need my space and my time too. And I, you will see it and you will hear it with me when I need my space and my time. You will definitely, definitely hear it with me, you know, when I need my space and my time. And people know right away, like, yo, Nat needs her space and her time. So that's what I do to people. I try to give them their space and their time. And when we link up, and we come back together, or we phone, or we text, it's all good. You know what I'm saying? You gotta learn. My mother always told me to let people long to see you. So I let people long to see you and give them their break. Let them, you know, like, yo, I wonder how she doing or whatever, unless you, they see you on Facebook putting up notes, but let them long to see you, you know? Let them wonder, you know, sometimes, like, what's, what's she doing, where's she at, you know? My mother always told me that, so I do listen to that and I do take key. And I know a lot of people with, you know, with me and my friendship, they know when Natalie's not in the mood and when Natalie doesn't want to be bothered because I just put that up on my Facebook. I'm easy to cut a person off, very, very easy. You know what I'm saying? I give you a lot of chances, I do, because I'm not that harsh on nobody. Everybody goes through their stuff and they need chances. You know what I'm saying? Some people, you can't give them no chances. You know, but some people you can give chances, like people that you know for years and years and years. I give them chances, you know what I'm saying? And just some people you just gotta cut them off quick, fast, let them go out of your life because they weigh your life down. You understand? So that's what it is. I feel so good underneath this tree, just stopping right here for a minute, you know, taking a breath because it's like, it's so muggy out here, it bothers my asthma, so I gotta relax and relax my, you know, my breathing a little bit. But that's it, guys. This is going on 10, almost 10 minutes, and that's it. I'm just here updating you guys, and then you guys know that I am fine, I am well, and I hope everybody's fine and well, too. And enjoy the today is tuesday i gotta watch my show pretty little liars yes i do watch that show guys that's one of one of my favorite shows there's a lot of shows that i got to watch 
Well, that's one of my favorite shows. So that's all I'm doing tonight. I'm gonna have me a little drink too tonight. I feel for a drink tonight, so I'm gonna probably um, vlog that and show y'all what I'm drinking. I'm not drinking no expensive vodka or nothing. You know what I'm saying? I'm drinking just, I think, Apple Amsterdam. I'm gonna mix that, make that into a slushy drink and have me a good old drink tonight. The kids, the little ones are gone. I'm home with the two oldest ones. They're going with daddy. So I have the house. And I'm just going to sip on some, watch me some TV. And thank God you got to speak. I know I said 10 minutes, but it's over 10 minutes. But you got to speak goodness, good things into existence. And that's what I'm all about. As of today, I'm speaking good things into existence. I'm being blessed. I am blessed. No matter what struggle come my way, I'm going to stay thinking positive, stay talking positive, stay doing positive, and just being me. No matter what. No matter what my flaws is, I love me. I love myself. I love everything. So, on that note, guys, you always know, peace and love. Be humble. Be you. And always stay true to you, guys. So, I see y'all again. Okay, peace. Finally made it to the number one spot. I ain't never gonna stop.